students mandate of the university is to cater to the needs of uh, uh, academic program research and extension in fisheries and ocean studies the headquarters of the university is situated in 87 acres of land in panangad in kochi on both sides of national highway 66 The university is well connected with air, water, road, rail and metro transport systems. The nearest airport is the Kochi International Airport which is just 35 kilometers away from the university headquarters. Kufus has five campuses, eastern, northeastern and western campuses in Panangad. and puduvai campus in fisheries research station in puduvai island in kochi and tiruvallam campus in tiruvananthapuram the university has demonstrated excellence in teaching research and extension training scholarship and creative work in fisheries and ocean studies that compare with international standard through various academic and training programs conducted through the five campuses we have five faculties uh, in this university uh, faculty of management humanities and social sciences faculty of engineering faculty of uh, fisheries. fisheries faculty of uh, ocean science and technology and uh, faculty of uh, climate variability and ecosystems management under these fa uh, five faculties we have several schools and departments and we are offering 30 masters programs and uh, two undergraduate programs mainly focusing on uh, various aspects of fisheries and ocean sciences the vice chancellor is the chief executive officer and the registrar is the administrative head of the university the governing council is the supreme executive authority of the university that is supported by the senate academic council department governing councils and board of studies there are four schools functioning in kufus the school of ocean science and technology school of fishery environment school of ocean engineering and underwater technology and school of management and entrepreneurship Under Faculty of Fisheries, seven departments are handling academic programs. Kufus has successfully carried out several short-term and long-term research projects. Many of them were externally funded on various topics related to fisheries and ocean studies. The research activities of the university are coordinated by the directorate of research through its four centers of excellence functioning under the supervision of director of research one center of excellence in sustainable aquaculture and aquatic resource management dedicated to aquaculture and allied aspects second one is a center of excellence in aquatic resource management and conservation basically this uh, center addresses the aquatic resources other than aquaculture pertinent to ocean and the inland water resources third one was dedicated to food called center of excellence in food processing technology and fourth one is uh, casred we call it center of Ex uh, center of advanced studies in research and entrepreneurial development dedicated to entrepreneurship development research programs and projects are mainly supported by Central Ministry of Earth Sciences NABARD Network Project on Disease Surveillance INCOIS Central Ministry of Environment and Forest Department of Science and Technology Rashtriya Krishi Vikas Yojana of Government of India and Government of Kerala The core areas of research include aquaculture aquatic ecosystem taxonomy biodiversity marine and inland fisheries mariculture ornamental fish culture post harvest processing and value addition 
marine molecular technologies and indigenous and traditional knowledge based research faculty and students of the university are selected and actively took part in arctic and southern ocean research expeditions organized by ministry of earth science government of india the university has nine research centers across kerala and two research chairs namely professor ali kun chair and pandit karapen chair to address the emerging areas of research the directorate of research also coordinate the phd and post doctoral programs of the university rural agricultural work experience is a major learning program at kufus students are exposed to the real experience of factory and field experimental learning program is also designed to overcome the lack of entrepreneurial on hand experience of young graduates to start their own business ventures in fisheries sector in these two programs we are aiming at making the student self sufficient by skill gaining that is in the experiential learning program as the uh, name indicates they learn through experience in experiential learning program what we mean by uh, one is to make them self sufficient for undertaking both simple as well as complex aquaculture activities directorate of extension established under kufus promotes the development of fisheries by way of providing necessary information imparting training and other extension support continuously to the fisher folk and aqua farmers especially in rural areas for the purpose a village adoption program has been designed and successfully executed by the directorate of extension since 2014 Apart from the village adoption programs, so there are also other projects like a farm advisory service, a fisheries technical and portal knowledge center, in which there also we are transferring the technology mainly to conserve the fishery resources and promoting the aquaculture activities in an eco-friendly and sustainable manner. Extension activities of Kufus has gained notable achievements in increasing fish production and improving. the living standards of fisher folk in addition to dissemination of innovations in the field of aquaculture and fish processing technology kufus also helps aqua farmers to identify the problems and offer right solutions at the right time a state of art animal health and environment management laboratory is functioning in kufus for this purpose we have been offering this facility now for more than a decade and uh, because of the reliability of the results that we are offering uh, farmers are coming from uh, different districts right from kannur uh, kasargod to uh, kollam trivandrum uh, farmers are coming to us as uh, approaching us so also the fisheries department are take, uh, is also taking our advice uh, we are part of the state disease surveillance team uh for uh, as soon as a disease is reported from any part of the state we uh, go there look at the disease problem and offer solutions since kufus campuses are located in central kerala with an aim to extend extension and training facilities to the south and north parts of kerala kufus is setting regional centers in southern and northern districts of the state the university is having jurisdiction all over kerala right now our headquarters is situated in the central kerala in ernakulam panangad but we wanted to expand our activities to other parts of kerala with the same we are establishing two regional centers one center is at the uh, malabar northern part of kerala north malabar at payanur at payanur the kannur regional center of the university is already being established similarly at kundra in uh, kollam we are having we will be establishing the kollam regional uh, center of the university 
Kufus has already automated office and state of art library as part of its mission to become a complete digital campus. In addition to a research museum, Kufus has a public aquarium which showcases both marine and freshwater fishes. Kufus believes that education should not be confined to the curriculum but it should totally enlighten students. Kufus gives equal importance to extracurricular activities like sports and cultural events. Kufus has stadium, swimming pool and gymnasium for the benefit of students. Kufus also has excellent hostel facilities for both men and women. The student community here has a pan India presence. And I've already known about this university. It's one of the reputed uh, university. Through my seniors and our other colleagues, I also consult them before coming here. So, and I thought this is the best place to study here as uh, it has a uh, flourished uh, fishery sector. Main thing in, during the PhD program, we do have the scholarship matter because uh, financial assistance is very important for the PhD scholars. So in that matter, it's, uh, it was very good. Units of National Cadet Corps, NCC, and National Service Scheme, NSS, are successfully functioning in the campuses of KUFUS. Students are trained and familiarized in social responsibility roles of responsible citizens through various programs carried out by NSS and NCC.